This video covers the general user operation of the EVOS OnStage incubator following installation by a qualified Thermo Fisher field representative. Begin by opening the valve on each of the individual gas tanks configured for use with the OSI. Adjust the output regulators to a range of 40 to 50 PSI. Open the water reservoir door by pulling on the door release handle. Remove the water reservoir, add warm water, approximately 50 degrees C to the max fill line through either fill hole. Replace the water reservoir and press the door close. Power on the OSI and microscope. Install the appropriate vessel holder into the stage top environmental chamber and place the vessel into the holder. Place the heated glass lid onto the environmental chamber. To start the incubator, select the incubator button from the capture tab. Select enable or use incubator. Define the target temperature, select and define CO2, oxygen and or humidity percentages if applicable. A shutdown option can also be defined at this time. The default selection is to manually shut down the incubator by deselecting enable or use incubator. Once the incubation is enabled, status, current, and target will be reported for each individual setting. A blinking blue LED on the control unit indicates that incubation features have been enabled and are being adjusted to the target values. A slow blink fade in, fade out blue LED indicates that the incubation features are on target and being maintained.